Hey guys, I'm about to start playing the Diablo Immortal PC version. So when I go to battle.net and I click on play, the first thing that it asks me is if I, it says, have you played on mobile? And if I've already played on mobile and you click yes, it gives you some instructions on how to link your mobile account to battle.net so i'm gonna go through those steps now uh firstly you open diablo immortal tap account button sign into your current battle.net account on your mobile device and it should merge so let's try that okay guys i'm currently on my phone and i just want to show you in google play store you need this program called battle.net battle.net right you need to make sure you download this app battle.net authenticator battle.net okay make sure that you can use both of these apps and you've set it up properly uh, so i got battle.net authenticator let's get battle.net install because if you can't get on battle.net it's very unlikely that you can get on um, diablo immortal with battle.net so i'm going to open that see what your friends are playing log in battle.net uh, just I choose to log in with Facebook because I've already linked that up previously new request 9mtq approve okay your login request was approved battle.net <clears throat> okay so once you have done that get notified when your friends are playing I don't really care okay so once you're on that then you can be sure that you can open Diablo Immortal. Okay, so once you're in the main screen, go to the top left where it's got guests. Actually, it's already connecting to battle.net. It's already done. Okay, top left, connect your account, log in. Welcome back. So that's my battle.net name. I will continue. Uh, connect my games, Diablo Immortal. Now it's having trouble. So if you have already played a bit of Diablo, there is no way that you can join it to your battle.net account. Because look how long I've been waiting. It's just not going to work. Okay, guys, so I'm back on my computer because my phone simply will not connect me to battle.net. So I'm going to just go on battle.net on my computer again. And obviously, it still needs to authenticate on my phone. But you know, you've seen me do that. And then when I'm playing Diablo Immortal, click play. Okay. Once you start the game and I click and I click on a server, it says, have you played on mobile? I'm going to click no. Are you sure you want to continue? Uh, confirm. Okay, so this is the only way that, um, so I'm gonna go to Oceania, Bloodsworn. I'm gonna tap to play. Okay, again, I'm going to pick to be a monk because that's what I am. And then customize my character. Yes, that's probably more uh, suitable for my, for my real life look. Just uh, customize it a bit. <clears throat> Enter name. It's going to be Magic Monk, obviously. Oh, I took my own name. Magic Monk 2. This is it. 
the dock for Wortham. God, that whole thing. Okay, Magic Monk 2. So there it is. Clicking it with the mouse. Uh, yeah, let's just get somewhere. Just want to level up first. The undead. What fate has befallen Wortham? More lives consumed by darkness. Get away from those villagers! Press and hold three, then aim with your mouse. Oh, so I'm pressing on the arrow key. Three. Oh, that's all right. That ability is not yet recharged. So it's just pressing on the number key, really. No, not yet. Not yet. A bit awkward. Okay, level two, so favor me. I just want to be level two and I'm gonna go on my phone and see if it can see that I'm level two. Log out. Okay, let's go back go back on my phone. Okay, so now I'm gonna completely reinstall Diablo. I'm gonna install it again. 1.92 gigabytes. Fortunately, I'm on uh, unlimited national broadband, so it's not really gonna matter. Just let it, let it uh, install again. Probably wait a couple of minutes. Okay, so let's play the game now. Okay, so seems to know that I'm playing it for the first time, which is good. Okay, oh, skip for now. Uh, yeah, I just want to make a video now. Okay, top left says guest, so let's click on that. Are you new to Diablo Immortal or do you have an account? Uh... Okay, let's just say I have an account because I played on PC. Okay, then I go to the Facebook link. TG60. Approve. Okay, I think that is my account. So let's now go to Oceania. Plus one. And do I have my Magic Monk 2? Yes, that's my Magic Monk 2. Okay, and I'm just going to go to level 3, go on my computer. Look at this huge person. Okay, I'm level three, so I'm now gonna go back to my computer and see if it says level three. And I'm gonna add the new skill here as well. Okay, so the new skill is assigned. All right, so I'm gonna quit the game. Okay, I'm just gonna quit it the traditional way. All right, so now I'm gonna go to my computer and see if uh, 
if I get level three in Magic Monk two. Okay, back on my computer. Okay, back on my computer again. Let's get Diablo Immortal up and running and see if I can go to level three for Magic Monk two. Okay, click approve on my phone again. Okay, let's get Diablo Immortal happening. Okay, it's the Bloodsworn server, so let's just tap to play it. There you go, level three. Okay, so that concludes the tutorial on how to connect mobile and PC gameplay. Thanks for watching guys, see you next time.